Welcome back, everybody. Uh, 853 now. Uh, this is Greg Taylor. Hi, Greg. How are you? Hey, Greg. Good, thanks. Greg, you're on a, a mission, a quest, my friend. That's right. You've been on a quest for well into the year now. <laughs> Since January, yes, sir. What is your quest? I am on a quest to set the world record for most ceremonial puck drops in one year. Well, I, I like, like it. I love Thank you very idea. much. Thank you very much. You're from, you're from Guelph? Yeah. yeah. And are you in banking or something? That's right, yeah, I'm a banker. Don't hold it against me too much, but yeah. Do you still work or did you take the entire year off? <laughs> no, I'm on actually, coincidentally, I'm on a paternity leave. We just adopted a little girl, so I'm driving the schedule that way. So I'm off till January. Oh, I see. Yeah. I see, so you're you're working in your puck drops with your paternity yes, uh, yes. leave. Yes, yes, it's a challenge. No doubt where's, about the, it. where's the furthest place from home you've done a ceremonial Puck drop. Rockford, Illinois, of the AHL. Was, and it was What's really the cool. Rockford team called? The, the uh, Ice Hogs. Oh, Big yeah. pig on skates on like the Like our Ice Hogs. Yeah. It's fantastic. I love that. It's just fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's What's the, what was the best place so far? Uh, it's, it'd be tough not to say Rockford, just because the whole atmosphere is crazy. When Rockford scores a goal, they go tick, 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 boom, which is the weirdest thing. But wow. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. You sent out letters and made phone calls to everybody. Yeah, NHL, everybody. Yeah. You have not dropped a puck at an NHL game no, yet. No, sir. Can you make it happen for what me? Is What's wrong with these people? I, come well, on I don't now. know. You know, some teams said no, some teams won't call me back. But some teams left the door a little open, and the Senators are one of the teams. They haven't given me a, a Who did you yet. talk to? Oh, there's pictures of you all over yeah, the place. That's no, yeah, there you go. Who that did was you talk to at the Senators? Do you know? Uh, I do have the name. I can give it to you. Is this, I would well, maybe we'll, just, maybe we'll just gently nudge and see. Would you? Yeah. Yeah. Would that be fit? Oh, the boss is here. The boss knows these people. Yeah. She can She can make things happen. Would that be great? Does Eugene Melnick watch the show? For <laughs> Let me, sure. I got him on my... Uh, would you mind checking that out? The speed dial. The speed dial. Oh, that would be the best. Any level of hockey. Anyway, I hope you get to do that, like oh, either at a Senators game or any NHL game. Yeah, yeah, a couple That'd of be the cool. Week. So, how many have you racked up so far? After this weekend, it'll be 32. What we are you doing this weekend? weekend? Uh, Tonight, Ottawa U opener against Lakehead. Didn't you go to Ottawa U? Or? I did, yeah. Yeah, yeah so I went to Ottawa U for sure. And, and uh, it's been a while, home. many years, but I'm back. It was great. Right. And then Coburg. Obviously, it launched you in a tremendous financial career. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> Coburg and Kingston tomorrow. So. Oh, cool. Kingston? RMC. Front, front yeah. next? No, no, RMC, the uh, oh. military college. Uh, oh, right, right. So right. you like when they score a goal in Rockford. Have you been to Sudbury? No. They, no. It's the best. What happens in Sudbury? They won't call in me Sudbury, in Sudbury <laughs> Wolves. Uh, when they score a goal, they take out this really old taxidermied wolf and it's on a pulley and you can hear it coming out. And they do the big howl. Oh, and this cross. thing, it, I don't know if they still do it, but when I was uh, there, it, I mean, it's dropping hair. It's disgusting. Oh, oh, that'd be awesome. It's awesome. <laughs> that'd so be awesome. are you going to, at the end of the year, that's it? January. Oh, I'm back to work in January. So uh, January right. 14th of my one year what, is up. What is the current record? The current record does not exist, sir. So I'm shooting for the moon. You're setting a record. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm shooting for the moon. You've you got to get an NHL team. Yeah, oh, sure. it, like, if anyone is watching, please. Come on, so Senators. Be the team. Be the one. Two minutes of your time. Exactly. <laughs> It'd be great. Okay, need, what's, yeah. the, what's the toughest part about a ceremonial puck drop? Hoping to heck I don't fall on the ice on my way at the center. Right, and whose hand do you shake first? Are it's the, the visitors. It's the visitors, yeah. So you drop the puck. I can walk you through it if you want. But. Have you ever ceremonially dropped a puck? Never in my life. I did once at a... Uh, St. John's Maple Leafs game when nice. they're in the AHL. Oh, that's excellent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's funny. Visitors first because the now, captain picks up the puck of the home team. Ah, right. And so here's the thing. I'm the Ceremon home team. You're the home team? Yeah. So ceremonial puck drop uh, is something that usually you drop the puck and guys are like, ha, 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 ha. But not today. Not today. Are you going hard at it? Let's do it. See, it's here's. It's, <laughs> would you tell him the uh, the protocol, the way it should go? It's He's a gentleman. A it's a gentlemanly activity. You know, there's none of that. Actually, at the ceremony puck drop, you're the visitor. <laughs> you feel that rock hardness right there? Oh my God. <laughs> I think I'm still missing part of the tape. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. So, okay, yeah, so it, it's supposed to be gentlemanly, obviously. So actually, the captains shake hands after the puck drop, after. and that never happens. Like, I, I, I you never do that. Yeah, no, unless it's playoffs. During, yeah, not during a regular season. So it's right. pretty cool. We got to go. So we got to do this? So. You show it to the camera? Yeah. Yes. And then you do that. No, yeah. see, that you violated the code. Mm -hmm. I don't care. Yeah. 
<laughs> thank you very much. I appreciate it. Listen, we'll Thanks, do what we can, can my hey, Thank you very much. We'll do what we can to see if we can get you the senator's oh, seat. Oh, wouldn't that be just amazing? I don't know. how We have no pull whatsoever, but, I mean, we could make the suggestion that it would be a nice idea. And here's Greg on, te on television now with his senator's jersey. Oh, you love the senators, don't you, Greg? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. I think you're probably your favorite team, eh, Greg? Your game, for yeah. Sure. Yeah. yeah, it's your favorite arena. No question about it. I mean, you'd be like more than willing to drop the puck there, the ceremonial puck. That would be very Absolutely. Cool. I would love to. It would yeah. be just a dream come true. I personally would love to ride the Zamboni, but that's another story. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> Thanks yeah, for coming no by to see us. Thank Thanks, you very man. much again. And good luck in your quest. Yeah. yeah. But we got to let us know how it all turns out. Oh, for sure I will. For sure I will. We'll be right back with more of CTV Morning Live after this. Thank you.